Well, in this box we have a group of watercolours by Joshua Crystal. He was an English watercolourist in the same period as Turner, and they have deteriorated quite a bit prior to them entering the National Gallery's collection. These works, this particular box, shows quite extensive damage caused by uh, light levels and um, overexposure to light. Part of the window mount in the past has covered up and protected the watercolour surface, so we have direct comparisons. We can see areas uh, that have not been exposed to light and areas that have been exposed to light. Uh, you can see it quite clearly how the, the light has altered the tones of the, not only the paper but the watercolour pigment itself. It's a very dramatic um, example and one that excites conservators because it gives us an idea of the history of the object and how it's been shown and displayed in the past. There are numerous examples uh, in the box showing similar types of deterioration where blues have turned to mauves and where greens have almost bleached out totally. From a pigment point of view there are two types of pigments, organic and inorganic pigments. The inorganic ones are certainly more stable. The problem with determining if a particular colour is more stable than another is that in the watercolour process the artist tends to mix colours together so you don't get one pure colour. If for example you use three different types of colour to, to get the wash that you're after, um, one particular part of that colour may fade eventually, um, altering the tone and the ultim ultimate hues of the watercolour itself. I mean the turners are in far better condition than these watercolours are in general and part of that is because of their limited exposure. As part of the bequest we can only show them in January and when they're not on display they're kept framed in a watercolour cabinet in a dark environment so as little light exposure throughout the year as possible. That's no doubt one of the reasons why Turner's watercolours are so spectacular. Thank you.